This course is going to give you a global overview of modern subatomic physics. In order to follow it easily, it would be good if you had a basic notion of classical mechanics and classical electrodynamics. You must also be able to understand and appreciate simple mathematical formula, including simple differential and integral equations. If you have the educational level of a third year student of uh, any scientific discipline, then you have the right level to follow this course. It would also be good if you had basic notion on uh, restricted relativity and quantum mechanics. But in any case, it will give you a quick reminder of this notion and their specific vocabulary. We will cover the atomic nucleus, its structure and its properties, and how they are put to practical use. We will guide you through techniques to create, accelerate and detect particles and measure their properties. The fundamental particles, namely the quarks and leptons, will be discussed in a lot of detail. With the same amount of detail, uh, the fundamental forces will also be discussed, as well as their properties. We will complete our tour of what is called the standard model of particle physics by discussing the Higgs boson, which prevents particles from moving at the speed of light. We will go beyond and discuss how we search for new physics beyond what is already well understood. That way, you will understand the use of the formidable machines, such that the LHC of CERN and its experiments. But also experiments using particles like cosmic rays, which are not man-made. And you will understand how uh, dark matter and dark energy contribute to forming the universe we live in. At the end of this course, you will be able to answer questions from your friends about the subatomic world, and you will be well prepared to continue your studies. So, once again, welcome to the course Particle Physics and Introduction.